today um we were going to be making well we are going to be making fur black boa slides so if you like this video if you find this video interesting or that it can help you in some way shape or form keep watching the video all right so this is the motivation y'all shout out to j baby because when i first started this fur i looked at j baby and also another lady i'm not sure of her name i will um oh excuse me put her name below in the description box for you guys because when i do my head and stuff for the fall and winter i looked at her and she helped me so 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 much so um i haven't finished this slide yet but this is the motivation y'all so just know it can get there this is the pretty pretty fur this is called feather boa i got this feather boa from hobby lobby i got two of them and the reason why I got two, because you always want to have more and not less. You know what I'm saying? I always have more than what you need so you can have some room to um, fix whatever you messed up. Or, you know, do whatever you need to do. So, the tools that we're using today, of course, scissors. Um, these glue sticks. These are hot glue sticks. I got these from Hobby Lobby as well. They were for like $50 for $4, if I'm not mistaken. And then a hot glue gun. This glue gun was like four dollars if i'm not mistaken so it's possible to get your look that you're going for with the hot glue gun so do not be scared and if fur rips off or you have a complaint about your fur coming up this is always a good alternative this or just sewing sewing the fur but this fur is kind of like uh it's kind of hard to sew so this is a great alternative I mean, this is not that expensive either. It's like five, six dollars. So, um, I'm not gonna keep talking your head off. Let's get into the video. So, what am I doing? Is I'm just going row from row. This is gonna get cut off later. Welcome back, baby. Was it packed out there? Okay. So, this is where I left off. I'm gonna just pull, push this back, and then I'm gonna start um, gluing it down. Please don't mess up the camera. Thank you. You ain't had to get me nothing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, so this is where I got the glue. And now I'm just about to lay it down. Make sure you push it down real tight. Hold it for a while. Because you don't want this glue coming up. But like I said, if it does come up, you always have an alternative, which is this one. <clears throat> So just press it down, press it down. Hold it for as long as you think you should be holding it. Okay. All right, so that's that area. We're working our way back to the edge. So I'm going to just put some more glue down. Y'all, it's not that hard. It's really easy. God knows. If you want to make some money, or if you don't even want to make money, if you just want to do videos and show people what you did, that they can do it too. Like J-Baby. Because J-Baby taught me a lot. I ain't going to lie. I looked at her videos over and over and over and over. And that's how I learned and I got better at it. But um, just hold it down. Hold it down. And if you do get, like, too far past the arm rim, you can always trim off what you need to trim off. <clears throat> but, yeah, it's really not hard. Just hold it down. We on the edge now. And I'm going to show y'all how I do my edges, like, when I come back up. I'm going to show y'all. But, yeah, we just hold it. Oh, these are so cute. I got an order for some black fur slides, so I was like, okay, yeah. I was out of my um, craft fur. Usually, I would use craft fur for, like, my projects. Um, I use white craft fur or black craft fur because, you know, of course, you can dye your fur. And I'm going to do another video. Mm, I got fur all in my mask. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm going to do a video and showing how I dye my fur. Okay. 
So we getting now. We getting now. We getting now. All right. So now what we're doing is. Okay. So now that it's glued right here. And you see that the fur is right there. Of course, I'm about to trim, do whatever I got to do. Hold on. Actually, I'm about to put some more glue right there. Because, yeah. Can you see that? Uh-uh. We can't have that. So, I'm just going to put some glue right here. Hold it down. Hold it down. So much fur in my mask. Oh my goodness. Mm. But yeah, you're just holding it down. I don't see what's the purpose of the mask if it's just going to get in, in my mask, you know. All right. So that's looking, you know, about right how I want it, you know. So now, since we're at the edge, we're about to loop around. So how I do my edges and how I loop it around is, um, I just put some right here, like that. So that's my next step. I go from this row, and then I just go down like that. And then, after I glue that down, we're going to go like that. So, that's how we're, that's how we're getting it done, y'all. So, just keep watching. Let's see how these turn out. <clears throat> to All right. Like I said, we're just going down. Hold it down, y'all. Like I said, hold down as long as you can, as much as you can, honey. Because you do not want these coming up. You do not want your slides coming up. That's, like, so embarrassing. And it just, uh, like, all your work you put in, you just got to start over. Like, it's just unnecessary. So, if you can help it, hold it down as long as you can. So, you ain't got to keep redoing these slides. And I feel like fur on fur works great, so, you know. You shouldn't have that much, that many problems with fur on fur with the hot glue gun. And if you got, like, a different type of material, like I had with the other slides that I had to redo, ooh, excuse me, you're going to want to use a different type of glue, a stronger whole glue. All right. So now that I went down that way, I'm about to go back up this way. So now I'm about to put the glue right up here and I'm going to show y'all exactly how I do it. Mm -hmm. Make sure you put enough glue. Make sure you have enough glue sticks while using this. Like I said, Hobby Lobby does have the 50 pack. For like four dollars but okay we're going this way so make sure you hold it down 